Gentlemen, let's start by talking about Kevin Garnett. Missed a month with the knee injury, suffered on February 19th, returned Friday night against San Antonio, played seven and a half minutes in the first quarter, seven and a half minutes in the third quarter, 0 for 4 in the first half, but 5 for 5 in the second half. What did you think about KG's return? Well, you see someone that's, that's obviously trying to take his time to get back, but that's where his maturity um, has, has really showed because right now he can come out there, maybe miss shots, but that's something you know that'll come. He'll come back to that rhythm. But the fact that he can come back second half, still be effective, still making shots, so he just finds his niche because it's hard to miss that amount of time then come back in the pace and keep up with the pace of the game. But he showed it, and that shows his, his, his amount of maturity. Seven and six in the 13 games that he missed. Uh, they, they get a win at San Antonio in his return. What were your uh, impressions of KG in his return? Well, I kind of agree with Eric. He took his time back, being a veteran, being there before. And a lot of times running on the treadmill or being in the pool when you're trying to work out can help. But I think the biggest thing for me, his voice. We, we call him the big ticket. Having him in the locker room, having him on the bench, when Big Baby and Perkins, those guys come, they see their big brother there to give them some advice. And I think that might have a bigger factor on it. And then also the fact that when he's on the court, whatever game plan that you have for him during the season, you have to have that same game plan during the regular season. If it's five minutes, ten minutes, whatever it has to be, you're going to give him that extra attention. So now all of a sudden, just because he's out there in his presence, he's making the, better, the game easier for everyone else.